Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, it is almost Valentine's Day, uh, about two weeks. So I thought it would be fun to do a video um, on a gift guide for your man for Valentine's Day. I just feel like every time I go to buy him gifts, I just like never, like, I feel like I know him so well until it's time to buy him gifts. And then I'm like, what is he even like? I don't know. Um, so these are just basically some things that I've bought him in the past that he really, really enjoyed. Um, but all of this stuff that I'm about to mention, I do recommend buying. And I think that some of them are pretty fun. If you would like to see my recommendations for Valentine's Day, keep on watching. So I bought him sneaker balls. And yes, I know that they are a mess. He's already used them. So he plays softball and um, he has a softball bag and I smelt it one time and I feel like it almost knocked me out. <laughs> it was pretty gross. If your boyfriend plays sports or anything like that, which I feel like most guys do, um, and they're just sweaty in general and you know, unlike us girls, we don't sweat at all. Um, but I actually, I saw them in TJ Maxx, but they were like flowers and I was like, uh, but it's a super good idea because his stuff stinks like really bad so I you know went online I went on to Amazon um, and searched for them and found them there I think they were like 10 bucks and you get six of them which is really cool and they were like little sports things um, and they also have like kind of like graphic designs and stuff like that but basically they're for like your luggage your shoes um, your gym bag anything that you really you know want to freshen up basically what you do let me take one out because they're just like little a little ball like this i don't know if you can see that yeah they're like a little ball like this excuse my nails i need to paint them and what you do is like it can like open if you see it's open and then it can close just like that and they smell i mean they smell they smell really good i like they like smell really fresh but there's like a hint of like like almost cinnamony 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 but yeah they smell really good uh i actually haven't smelled them before because i just i mean i didn't open them i just gave it to him and didn't smell them but mm, i like might steal one is that bad indian giver i don't know but um anyway so the only thing is is that he said his feet like he he tried them in his shoes and he tried them in his bag and he thinks that they were just kind of too far gone for these to help. He thinks, though, that if you bought a new pair of shoes or a new bag or washed your bag and then kept on using these, that these would really help out the smell, which is always good. And like I said, 10 bucks on Amazon. I'll, I will link it down below, as I will with all of these products. Okay, yeah, moving on. This next one, um, I, there's cards in here because I made him give it to me. <laughs> so this is his wallet with all of his cards in it. Yeah. The company is called The Ridge and this is like The Ridge Wallet. It's basically made out of aluminum. Um, if you can see, there's a money clip on the back and you can also get a cash strap as well. They have a different option for that. I, the reason why I got this for him is I don't know about you guys, but he loses cash like crazy. Like crazy like i feel like i could steal money from him and he would never know it was gone like it's it's crazy to me because the second i lost it i would know i would know and he's just like not like that like he lost a hundred dollars and it was just like like the next day my dad had found it like spewed across our living room and i was like what the heck and, he, and my dad was like whose is this and i was like i'll give you two guesses mm, dave and dave so basically that's where this idea sprouted from and he adores this wallet like he like showed it off to everybody not everybody thought it was as cool as him but i think it's pretty awesome this wallet holds one to 12 cards um it blocks rfid wireless theft is replaceable elastic but it says it can hold one to 12 cards without stretching out. Um, so you should be good on that. Backfire limited time warranty, uh, 6061 to T6 aluminum. But also it's so small. I, I don't know if you can really tell, but like, okay, compared, I have the, I have the iPhone X, but like compared to my phone, it's literally so small. And then the money strap is super tight, so he can't lose any money which is great um and then yeah he gets all of his cards in one place 
but yeah i think this is really cool and it's like super industrial manly you know gunmetal next i want to talk about face masks so before he met me i like he was like one of those guys that um like washed his face like with his body soap which is not the best thing at least i don't think so that's i mean like you know i would do face masks around him try the ones where you just like spread it on your face and then you wash it off and stuff i've gotten him to do a couple of those but he really prefers sheet masks and this is kind of just like an extra little thing that you can throw in his present just to like you know spruce it up and you know have something fun for both of you guys to do i got him this brightening mask and they're all sheet masks because that's his favorite he kind of just likes to like pop it on and pop it off and he doesn't like anything that's like uncomfortable feeling but these are these are super great ones i just picked them up at cvs when i was there the other day getting stuff for myself <laughs> so i just threw these in there um but you can also get ones off of amazon for pretty cheap you know tj maxx has a lot for really cheap that like are really fun i got him some of those for christmas there was like a 14 karat gold one and then a silver one and he really liked those as well so yeah face mask 101 just a cute little thing to just like have extra in there this one's kind of funny and kind of like an inside joke between me and dave but i feel like they're gaining in popularity so i wanted to mention it in this video so i got him a fanny pack yeah so it's kind of manly well not kind of it is manly it's a manly fanny pack um he hasn't worn it yet <laughs> but it's really nice it's a really nice 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 it's a really nice leather material. Um, it's a really nice leather material. It has two compartments, you know, one for your stuff, the big compartment, and then, you know, one for one for his stuff, the little compartment. And these are just packets. Keep it fresh. Keep your fanny pack fresh. So backstory on this is that we go to uh, theme parks a lot. Um, we both love roller coasters and, you know, just the atmosphere of theme parks. And we went to Disney World, which was so much fun. But I didn't want to carry anything around, and all I had was a floral fanny pack. <laughs> so guess who wore that? Yeah. If you don't believe me, I have a picture. So I didn't want to torture him anymore. I just, you know, I figured, you know, next time we go to a theme park, when he, you know, carries my stuff around the park yet again, he could at least look manly doing it although he did get compliments we went to cedar point it was closer to where we where we live right now and he was able to wear a blue one but i don't know what happened to that blue one for disney world it just didn't make it um so it was floral he actually got a lot of compliments on that blue one and yeah he was like pretty stoked he was like i'm bringing fanny packs back and so I figured, you know, if you want to bring them back, you better bring them back in style. So, anyways, this is kind of a fun, cute gift. Um, kind of a gag gift. I actually saw one that had, like, a beer belly on it. Um, I'll put a picture. But I was, like, kind of... I kind of wanted to get him that one, but then I was like, no, I'll get him a nice one because I already tortured him with the floral one. <sighs> Meh, maybe next time. This is kind of more for me than it is for him but i did not i did not know that when i bought it but this this product is like it just is so good so it is the tom ford for men conditioning beard oil so it doesn't come with a cap to put on over it so he like transports this around with him and it's the only that's the only complaint i have about the only one only one. Okay, so we have it in the tobacco vanilla. I'm probably saying that really wrong, but it's spelled V-A-N-I-L-L-E. -L -L -E, vanilla. I don't know. When he puts it on his face, I mean, it really does condition his beard. It does what it says. On the website, it says, This beard oil conditions, softens, and nourishes the beard with a lightweight blend of almond jojoba. Jojoba? Jojoba? jojoba and grapeseed oils grapeseed oils as well as vitamin e but he loves this he says that it really conditions his beard um it kind of makes it shiny and silky which is nice and i love his beard i think it's so like manly and just like mm. but whenever we're kissing it i like have like a red mustache after so it's like nice that this can condition it and make it like a little softer for that 
besides that the smell is just crazy it's so good it just like it's such uh, i just you just want to smell this face it's like it's really strange and this is gonna sound really really weird but i just like sometimes catch myself just smelling his face when he wears this i know that's weird but like it's true <laughs> like it's just so good um and they have it at macy's nordstrom sephora um it's between 50 and 52 bucks which is a little bit pricey but it's worth it it's one fluent ounce and i mean he's had it since christmas and if you can see he's only used about this much of it so it does last a long time and you don't a little goes a long way so this will last you for a while um i actually got this recommendation i have to give a shout out to um james tati's husband whenever he did his products his recommended products and that came out like right around christmas so i was like yes thank you so i thought like not enough people really talk about like the products give men so i hope this is as helpful to you as it was to me but yes i love this guy so good if you get if you get anything from this video this guy because it helps you out too girl this is the keels this was another recommendation from james tati's husband this is the close shavers squadron uh, smooth glider precision shave lotion this is great um i personally got the 2.5 fluid ounce which is nine dollars and then uh the five ounce is 16 sorry i'm like looking at my notes <sighs> uh, it smells good but he says it really like conditions his skin and it's really like helps to get around there which i wouldn't know anything about but he says it's really good so i'm putting in this video okay so i got him i don't know if you can tell it's like a little i know it's like kind of dirty but this is a leather like man travel bag yeah i know um like a male beauty bag kind of but um so it's like really great i got this off of e-bags the same place i got the fanny pack off of if you go right now they're having a 20 percent off sale with if you use the code save 20 um i don't get anything from that i just was on the site and was like ooh, code save 20 like anytime you can save money why wouldn't you especially when it's 20 percent um and these were I, not that pricey. I, I think they're like this one was might have been like 40 bucks, but it's real leather. 40, 50 bucks. I don't remember. But um, it's really great. And if you open it, so if you open it up, it's like black because, but so you can't see it. But there's like a zipper compartment back here where you can put stuff. There's also these like nets back here. I don't know if you can see that. There's like two little nets. Um, and then the, the I, this is the coolest part I thought. Um, if you open the bottom, it has a whole other compartment where you can put like travel items and your toothbrush. And then there's even like another little like guy right there. Um, I just thought it was awesome um, that it comes with that and honestly something that I would want. So I figured he'd like it too. And also when we went to Florida, his stuff was just everywhere. And I was like, you need something like this to like, organize your beauty stuff don't forget about the 20 percent off for the save 20 like i said anytime you can save a dime or a nickel or a penny really anything a half a penny like save it why not last but definitely not least they are boxer briefs um they're really nice boxer briefs, but mm, they're briefs nonetheless. Yeah, I kind of get him like random ones of these every time I get him a gift just because I think it's super, super fun and funny and he like loves like colors and weird things and I don't know, it's kind of funny to see him wear them too. It's just like, it's really funny. Um, so I got these ones for him from Crazy Boxer and they are, <laughs> if you can see, um, they have donuts all over them which i think that's he loves donuts he loves sweets all of that so um this thought that'd be super fun they're super soft um and he really likes them so these are from crazy boxer i got them at tj maxx i think for like 10 bucks 
maybe it was $5.99 I don't know somewhere in that price range but still super cheap uh, like the masks and you know the dryer balls it's just kind of something fun to like pop into a gift just to like either get a laugh or like you know just something interesting and fun and cute and different um i was looking on amazon and they have a lot of like cute ones that are kind of similar to this but definitely go check out your local like tj maxx or marshall's and just check out what they have over christmas time i really wanted to get him these but i couldn't because they weren't his size Ugh. but they were basically like buffalo wing <laughs> they had buffalo wings all over them buffalo wing boxers and i thought that they were so awesome and so fun but like i said they weren't his size so whoever bought those good job i'm jealous anyways the next pair this is kind of like our inside joke um i've been trying to move get him to move out to um california with me for so long um for three years to be exact uh maybe two and a half i don't know round three i kind of played on that this christmas and bought him <laughs> these these bad boys um and they just say california republic on them with our with the bear and i just thought that they were cute and fun and his favorite color is purple so these were a win okay guys well that wraps up this video uh thank you guys for watching and i hope you got some really cool uh valentine's day gift ideas let me know in the comments below if you bought anything and if you liked it thank you for watching Subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!